Have you ever wondered how to make fakes or even objects appear magically behind or before you in your videos? You are in the right place because in this tutorial, I'm going to be taking you through step by step on how you can create stunning appear behind or before you videos right here in Capcom. Whether you are a beginner or an experienced editor, this technique is going to add an extra flair to your videos and help captivate your audience. Grab your creativity and let's go. Looking and recording your video. The next thing you want to do is to import your video to your to CapCut. Once you import your video, for me, this is the video I'm going to be working with. I'm going to copy this video by scrolling to the left, to my right. Then you click on copy to duplicate the video. The next thing you are going to do is to come here and bring the object you want behind you. So I'm going to use this CapCut logo as the object that will appear behind me so i want it somewhere here then i'm going to reduce it now the next thing i want to do is the one i've duplicated i'll bring it as an overlay on that one before i do that this image i want to add some animation to it you can add this or add any animation that you want but scroll to style then you will see all this trending i like this particular one that's what i use in my intro video allow it to load or even updates appear magically then leave it here so the do the overlay layer bring it under that object tap on the overlay layer scroll to the right tap on cutout remove background once the background is removed let's see the effect Have you ever wondered wondered how to make... so i'm going to mute the sound of this one have you ever wondered how to make fakes or even objects appear magic so let's adjust that object to be at the back or even objects appear magically behind or before you in your so that is how to put objects behind your videos whenever you are editing after importing your video to CapCut the next thing you are going to do is add text tap on text tap on add text now let's enter thanks for watching under here you can see fonts this is the font i use you can decide to change it to any one but i like this font here we have style you can change your font style then we have effects you can decide to add effects to your font maybe something like this then on the animation part i want to add the animation of fade in i want the text to fade in then you adjust the timing I want it to fade it slow fade in slowly then you tap on fade out allow it to fade out also adjust it fade out slowly then you adjust that text to the end of your clip once that is done you export the video after exporting it, tap on new project again. That same clip, the one you just exported with text, bring it. Then you bring the original clip again as an overlay text. As an overlay clip, rather. This is my initial video. Then you bring it like this. If you adjust it this way, you might not see the real results. But adjust it to align with the uh, with the initial uh, video. 
then scroll to your right, tap on cut out, then you remove the background. I was not in this, I was not in this uh, environment. I just removed the background and just to make it look nice. I was in the house while I shot this video. You can see that the texts are not aligned. So you align it. Can you see? So this is how to do the before text effect in CapCut. Please don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel.